Hello and welcome to The Future is 3D. My name is Jeff Christiana, and today we'll be talking about the LCD and keypad new to The Future is 3D. Right now we have a 16 by 16 steel, glacier steel um, printer that has now been connected with an LCD and keypad via some wires and a ribbon cable. We are disconnected from the laptop. See the USB cable is unplugged. The diode has been installed in order for the Adreno board to stay powered. So you are looking at a printer or computer free, laptop free or whatever. Um, you need to be able to print directly from your printer without the need of a computer. So, let's take a look at how it's wired. So when you get your, your kit, or it becomes wired like this, you're going to have your display and you have some wires here. So, what you want to do, take a look at this one here, your first pair black and red this is your five volts and this is your signals so your five volts make sure that, that goes to five volts and this one does not go to five volts they look exactly the same you just want to make sure pins in one, one and two power one is negative two is positive so back to the ramps <clears throat> what you want to do is your five volts comes off of these two pins so you've got your minimum max, min max, end stops, and we're taking five volts off the bottom two pins of the three on the far right. Now on the right hand side here, we've got your signals. So you're looking at seven or six, you got six total here, and these headers need to be soldered in place. We can send you those headers if you do not have them. I believe I'm just going to include them in the kit. They're very easy to solder. Now that, all these, these six wires and the two wires power your display. Once you have that, and you have the Marlin RC 2.1 that's available on my website, or you can go into Replicator G, go into Upload, and go to Marlin 1.4 and then select uh, Release Candidate 2.1 for single or dual head. Now I'm working on, on well actually you want to select it for either the 1280 or the 2560 Adreno board. I don't have uh, 2.1 set up for that yet. So the uh, you'll also see options in there for the dual head which are above that and I have that marked as experimental so um, if you want to give that a try you can but um, as right now it is not working so you just want to do the release candidate 2.1 and it'll say on there for LCD and keypad so once you download that firmware your LCD screen will fire right up and give you instant stats of your printer so the next step is to hook up your keypad. So when your keypad comes, <clears throat> look like this. And you've got your ribbon cable on the front here. So to wire it up, very simple, 10 pin ribbon cable, plug right in, pin one to the left, <clears throat> run your ribbon cable, and that goes to your auxiliary two port on your ramps 1.4 board. So you just plug it in, pin one on the left, and when you have a successful connection, you can go ahead and press, let's see if I can get back here, press the uh, enter key here, and you've got control. So that's how to hook up your LCD screen and keypad. And remember, you can always email support at thefuturist3d.com and we will walk you through this. I'll also try to put up some uh, documentation, some pictures that will help you through this. Next video, we'll show you how to use it. We'll talk to you later.